Oh, you know, I'm gonna see here again, guys. Well, a little reviewing table, a little, uh, a little messy today. Uh, working on some seedlings to uh, plant my garden. Working on clearing my garden out today. Uh, sorry if I haven't responded to comments and stuff recently. That's been busy between work and, uh, you know, it is springtime, so I'm trying to get the garden and stuff ready. Um, get some food planted. Uh, got a bunch of stuff here. Got uh, several different types of tomatoes here. Um, got some peppers. I got some spring onions. I got some cilantro, some basil, some... I don't even know. I forget half the stuff I got here. I think soybeans or something. But yeah. Uh, that's what all these are. Uh, just I should have started these a long time ago. Uh, but just between work and making YouTube videos and stuff, I let it get behind. So anyway, uh, I'm trying to catch up on that. So I haven't really been paying close enough attention to comments and things like that. Uh, for the people who won my prizes, I haven't shipped those yet. Uh, I was trying to determine whether or not I was going to ship them. When I got the knives made or not, and I've decided no, nah, I'm not going to make the people who won wait that long because uh, it's going to take me a while to get all the knives done. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and ship those probably uh, probably within the week. I'll get those shipped out to you. Uh, the prizes that folks won. Anyway, um, so if you have not already sent me your address, make sure you do that. Send me a PM or something, or send it to uh, IronMonkeyZ at gmail.com. All right, and today I was doing a little unboxing. Look what I got here. Got a tube. A big long tube. We're gonna see what the hell's in it. So I use my Benchmade 555 to open this bad boy up. Maybe. I'm not sure how exactly I got this kept. Oh wow. Got a wooden plug in it. It's pretty impressive. I wonder if the other side's got a plug. Wow, yeah, both sides have a plug in it. Alrighty. Well, I guess we're going to see how this thing pries. Doing all right so far. How the hell are you supposed to open this? Oh wow! It's actually got metal pins in it. I'm gonna have to cut this down the center, I guess. Hmm. 
It's a hell of a packing job, I'll tell you that. I'm actually really impressed with it. It's a pain in the ass to open. But when you see what's inside, you'll see why I appreciate it. Good lord, this thing is thick. That knife's not working out too well. Let's see what the turbulence can do. There we go. <laughs> Finally got it open. That is one hell of a packing job. This actually is a shipment from the New Jersey Steel Baron. Um, they got really decent prices, very competitive. Um, I ordered this two days ago. Two days ago? I ordered it on Tuesday. Today's Thursday. And it's at my house. The shipping was reasonably priced. As you can see, they really care about it coming to you the way they sent it to you. So heck of a good packaging. And that's New Jersey Steel Baron. New Jersey Steel Baron LLC. Uh, check them out. Uh, I heard about them from Gavco. Um, I think that's where he gets a lot of his knife making material. And uh, I asked him, hey, where do you get that? Because he seems to get some thicker steel than what I'm usually able to find. And I asked him where he got it, and he said New Jersey uh, Steel Baron. And they do. They have a lot of uh, thicker, not thicker, wider uh, blanks or bars for you. Um, I think they had up like six inches wide on different, you know, it depends on the thickness. But, yeah, they have a great selection, so go check them out. Um, this is 1095, high carbon, annealed. Um, this is 5, 30 seconds thick by 2 inches wide. 48 long and there are 